Hello YouTube, Chaos Toll Productions back here with another video. In this one I'm going to be going over um, a Brickmania haul that I got and I will be building these and um, yeah so let's get into it. I'll show you guys what I got and then um, I also do have a Minifig Co. package coming so um, that might be at the end of this video or um, depending on what comes I might make a separate video for that but let's get into this one. So. Starting off, um, Brickmania's new modern U.S. Army Rifleman. I got one in each um, skin variant. So, here they are. And I'll take uh, take them out of here so we can look at them. Um, so, these ones come with the new um, 3D printed helmet, which I really like. And then they also have this new... Um, new artwork on it, uh, which I also really, really like. Oops. So, yeah, compared to the older ones, these ones are much better. However, the price point is a lot higher, and these um, these get expensive fast when you when you add them up uh, in your cart. So, um, I think it's also has to do with the um, the new, just the new artwork and the helmet being three D printed and printed on top of, and then also the gun itself. Um, so, so yeah, those are, those are the, um, modern U.S. Army Riflemen, and then I also got the modern Marine Riflemen, also three more in each, uh, skin variant, so, let's take a look at these ones, real quick. so these ones, um, also look very cool, I like how they have that kind of green, um, color in them because they're the marines um and then i also really like the head the head printing on this guy um cool vest just really cool guys uh overall so these guys will be added to the base um and then i also just got some uh, more modern modern guns and rifles that i can use on some uh more guys that i have coming in the mail from the minifig co so uh yeah those and then some helmets for the guys that are coming from the minifig co uh, and then right here i have um i got two more neptune spear u.s navy seals and these actually i did add with um i did add with this kit right here so this is the uh, mhx ghost hawk advanced stealth helicopter and uh, you had the option to add two neptune spear navy seals to go with this one so um, I have now I have seven Neptune Spear Navy Seals that can be um, they're going to be coming down from the strings that hang off this helicopter. So this is the one I'll be uh, reviewing, and then I also will be building this one. So uh, this is the MH sixty S Seahawk uh, multi mission maritime helicopter from Brickmania. Also one that I've been really meaning to get. This one is a uh, really cool color scheme and just looks sick uh, over in general. Um, this one comes with a stand, so that one will be more of a display piece, but you can take the stand off and then um, sliding doors on this one. So I'll get back to you guys when I finish building them. Okay, here's just a little progress. I just dumped out all the bags. Here's a look at all the pieces, the instructions. And then I just wanted to quickly show the crew that it came with, including Cairo the dog. And then this exclusive Neptune Spear Navy SEAL who comes with a bloop gun. Not sure if that's a name, but it's basically like a sawed off grenade launcher. And then he's got the bandolier that has the grenades. And then in the back he's got the um, bag for dog treats. Uh, yeah, so get back to one when I'm done. Okay guys, back here with the MH Ghost Hawk fully completed on the stand. And I must say this thing was incredibly fun to put together. Um, just came together so seamlessly. So let's just start by going over um, the front. I have the two guys, two pilots in the front. I have the two like, co-pilots right, um, or the co-crew right there. Uh, manning the miniguns. There's also this Neptune Spear um, Navy SEAL that came with the helicopter. And then he's, I uh, have him right up here in the main part along with Cairo the dog. Um, and then down here I have two more additional Neptune Spear seals just coming down. Here we have the um, MHX Ghost Hawk 
and well this is the printed um display stand right there and then um these doors are also printed those windows um i thought those were stickers just looking at it um but they're actually printed so that's really nice we got the um i believe these are rocket pods and then the drop tanks for fuel uh we have the engine intakes intake Okay, so my camera cut off, but those are the engine intakes. And then uh, just going over to the back, these doors um, open very seamlessly. They're on a new mechanism right here that the studs go inward. Uh, I find that really cool. And then there's just so many cheese slopes on this build. I didn't expect it to be that many, um, but it just makes it look really angular and really um, stealthy, really cool. So um, on the bottom, there's actually a retractable landing gear and this is what it looks like uh just like that it's printed on both sides of this um like lego frying pan but it's used as a wheel here and this goes right up in the in the bottom by folding it up like this and then like that and then closing these hinges um and then these ones right up here these ones also close but um much easier I find these to be so what you do is you take you just basically push these in and they go just like that seamless with the with the bottom right here and then these two pieces also go in just like that uh, once once the wheels in all the way they go in just like that so really really seamless design nice job um Dan Siskin for uh, recreating this bottle this was uh really cool so um yeah that's that's pretty much it the five blade propeller on top and then also the five blade rotor and i'll just go over these guys over here real quick i just got my i just armed them out with some guns took them out of the packaging and then here's a better look at them and yeah so let's just go over the instructions. There were, I think, about 70 pages total. Um, yeah, 70, 70 pages total to get this thing done. But uh, very advanced techniques in this. Um, and, like, look how many pieces you use already on the first page. So it is pretty, um, pretty advanced for a Lego kit. Um, but, yeah, there was one mistake that I also found in the instructions, and it's... Uh, when you get to this um, this part up here, the uh, it's there's a gap that's shown on the instructions. It doesn't show you how to build it right, uh, but it actually is supposed to be closed, like on this side. So I had to go back and fix it, and um, now it is now it is closed. I'm talking about there was a gap right here that wasn't supposed to be there, but it's seamless now, so looks good. And yeah, there it is. Okay, one more thing I forgot to mention is um, the extra pieces are included uh, in the kit for um, if you wanted to take the bat wings off, which are these, and you can make it a seamless seamless design without the sides. Um, if you wanted to have a more sleek, more um, cleaner look, uh, so it'll just go right where those come out. And then just to finish off the video, I thought I'd show... Um, some of my new car collection uh which would be these two police cars i got two more and then i did get a this police truck right here as well as um some of the new speed champions which i'm really a fan of so i got these ones um my favorite one being the lamborghini countach and then that's probably my second favorite because i like the color this one's my third favorite i did modify it slightly so it didn't have those like blue and I think they were red or yellow, blue and yellow pieces right there. I just made them black. So it's a lime and um, white completely. And then, um, yeah, the last thing over here is I did get this Star Wars kit, not finished with it yet. And then also these two. So yeah, that's a new Jurassic, um, that's a new Jurassic Park kit right there. And I'll actually go over here. It comes with an exclusive dinosaur, which I have right over here. So. I had to get this because it's um, the new movie's coming out soon, and this this is a huge dinosaur. Me and my brother like to collect these, so yeah. Um, stay tuned for my next video, guys. I'll be going over the MH60S Seahawk helicopter, 
and um, and maybe the uh, minifig co package. Thanks for watching.